I wonder why Kimmy didn't show up with Coco. Because her dog, the chicken. <laughs> hey, I made a joke. <laughs> That's it. I don't care how cute his dimples are or how bad I need a date for Friday. I wait for no man for more than an hour and a half. <laughs> I'm pathetic. <laughs> Hi, Jeremy, you're late. Is that Jeremy? Hey, Mr. Temple, did you wait for no man? Michelle. He sounded cute. Next time, give the guy a break. Whoa, baby! Not so fast. You little sugar freak. All right, now, Michelle, while I make this triple dip, Double fudge, whipped cream sundae with a cherry on top. Just out of curiosity, is there some kind of, uh, I don't know, secret about this uh, party Becky's throwing? I can't tell you. You missed a spot. Thank you. Oh, well, Michelle, you know, I, I sure would love to share this ice cream sundae with you. I'd sure love that, too. Hmm. Well, then, let's talk about that secret, shall we? What do I do? What do I do? Well, you can start by holding the spoon while I put on these chocolate sprinkles. Chocolate sprinkles? Mm-hmm. And your favorite and mine. <laughs> The cherry. The party in Bayshire. Now drop that cherry. Mm. <laughs> Aha. Baby shower. It's worse than I thought. Thanks, Michelle. You're welcome, my boy. You're welcome, my boy. Uh, there's nothing else I want to know. I hate to spoil your dinner. Let me have a bite. Is it time for my party yet? Nope. You still have two hours and 29 minutes to go. How long is that? Two Sesame Streets and a Mr. Rogers. <laughs> oh, I'll never make it. Now, ready, get set, open the present you brought as fast as you can. All right, there we are. We're opening. We're having a great time. Oh, good. Look how fast this guy's going. Oh, good. It looks beautiful. Hey, that's it. Great. Those are some beautiful presents. Now, hold them out to the shop and see what you got. Love it. Love it, love it, like it, love it, like it, love it. That looks bigger on TV. Do you want to help me make breakfast, Michelle? Sure, I can smash some eggs. Whoa. You don't smash them. You crack them on the side of the bowl very gently. Observe. Do you think you can do that? Duh. <laughs> Michelle, that was perfect. Thank you very much. Now, would you like to scramble them up? I sure would. <laughs> Here's your glass of kitchen water. Are you sure it's from the kitchen? Taste it. Yep, that's the kitchen. My daddy's always leaving me. How come? Because he's spatula of the month. <laughs> you say they so. may look cute, but don't be fooled. They've been sneaking into G-rated movies all over town. In fact, they're known as Snake and Sniffles. Which one am I? I'll get one. Hold it, Michelle. Hold it, hold it, hold it. <laughs> I'm just trying to help. Well, thank you, but you never take from the bottom. Always take from the top, like this, you see? 
I could have done that. Now could we lick the spatula? Yes. Now we can lick the spatula. It's about time. Whoa, 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 Michelle. Michelle, now we have to make some more frosting. Dude, what fail. Boy, do I got a headache. Ha, 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 ha. Maybe you didn't see this arrow in my head. Joey, I'm dying out here. Well, Michelle, maybe you should just go to your big finish. Do I have to do this? Mm -hmm. Everybody knows that a pie in the face is the oldest joke in the book, but we also know that it always gets a laugh. Okay, let me have it. Okay. Are you ready? I'm ready. Hi, honey, I'm home. <laughs> Hi, girls. Hi, Dad. I'm sorry I'm late. At the last minute, I had to rush out to Oakland to cover a warrior's practice session. Traffic was miserable. A camera... Give me a break. Huh? Don't huh me. You waltz in here 25 minutes late and expect sympathy? Huh. Well, I didn't know you had... I have cleaned the house and washed my clothes and ran a daycare center for socially deviant munchkins and Mr. Oprah. Ran this one to a ballet lesson, this one to the dentist. No cavities, thank you very much. Do you realize that I have slaved over a hot stove so you could have a hot meal when you come home? Huh? <laughs> Jesse, I'm sorry. Sorry. <laughs> sorry. Sorry doesn't change the fact that my chicken tetrazzini is ruined. Ruined. It's all dried out. But do you have the common courtesy to call me and tell me you're going to be 25 minutes late? No! <laughs> I am not an animal. Oh, my God, what's happening to me? <laughs> I'm turning into June Cleaver. Uh, uh, <laughs> Two more, Michelle. Whoa! Whoa. Dip it in there, put it in, and blow it. There goes a double. Watch, that, Michelle. Double. Huge. Watch huge how bubble, I do. Watch how I do. Now watch. take it up. Now blow it. Blow Wait, it. Watch how big mine is. Mm. Good. Well, I got bubbles to the top. <laughs> watch this, George. Look at all these bubbles. Watch. Wait, wow. Look at this. Watch mine. Watch mine. Hold on. Not Check bad. Watch. <laughs> Triple. Watch this. Watch how many I can do. Right, now, boys, I don't want you playing, but I sure hope you finished your homework. Yeah, we finished our homework. Yeah. <laughs> Good morning, troops. It is now 0700, and it's time to attack the enemy. Grease, grime, slime, sludge. And that's just Joey's room. <laughs> now, what is dirt? Get bad. I can't hear you. Get bad. <laughs> Daddy's really into spring cleaning, isn't he? Steph, it may be spring cleaning to you and me, but to Dad, it's Christmas. <laughs> Permission to whine? Permission denied. Get back in line, soldier. Yes, your spotlessness. <laughs> Look alive! Oh! Don't do that. I'm having a beautiful dream. We hired a cleaning service. Now, troops, you all have your assignments. Now sound off. Up. If we find dirt, we will attack. If we, we find, find dirt, we will attack. attack. And we'll get Danny off our back. We'll get Danny off our back. Sound off. One, two. Sound off. Dirt band. Beep, 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 beep. Jesse, do I want to come in there? Yep, come on in. You're going to love it. <laughs> huh? Huh? <laughs> Well, I do love it. This is great. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> Never hug me in front of my power tools. Oh, you see that, Jess? The babies will be just fine, Helen. Let's go. Did you say babies? <laughs> Did she say babies? That's what I said. You're having twins. <laughs> Who's having 
twins. <laughs> you are. Congratulations. Oh, honey! Twins, I just want to know if it was a boy or a girl. We'll celebrate tonight. All right. Are you all right? Oh, no, no, I'm fine. No, I'm great. It's uh, extra baby, so I'm extra happy. <laughs> <laughs> you know, before I was just uh, responsible for one human life. Heck, now I'm responsible for two human lives. <laughs> no, I'm fine, really. I mean, I, I'm so... Can I just lay down real fast for a second? <laughs> can you just uh, click the oxygen on as fast as you can? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You know, I'm really yeah, sick. Very of fun. You really do. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Good I'll combat. Oh, no, 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 Maybe a little nap wouldn't hurt. You guys are gonna love this. I found out why Uncle Jesse is so obsessed with finding cool names for the twins. I called Grandma, and she said that Uncle Jesse's real name is Hermes. Hermes? I married a Hermes? I got an Uncle Hermes? Yep. He was teased so much in kindergarten that he begged Grandma to change it to Jesse. Thank you for finding my shoes, Uncle Hermes. You're welcome. Where'd you call me? Uncle Hermes, that's your name. <laughs> Who told you my name was Hermes? Grandma. She's lying. Jess. Okay. It's Hermes. <laughs> Come on. You said you wanted to know what it was like to be pregnant. Now get down here. <laughs> Done. Not yet. Ah! <laughs> okay, now I'm done. <laughs> I'm not wearing this thing. It's got to weigh 25 pounds. Wait a minute. So does this thing. And I went through a lot of trouble to get that sympathy pad for my childbirth coach. And if you really wanted to know what I was going through, you would wear it for more than five minutes. Unless, of course, you're not man enough to be pregnant. Oh. <laughs> I'm as much man as you are. I'll make you a little bet. Since we've been arguing over wallpaper for the nursery, I'll bet you that you can't last one day in that pad. And if I win, I get to put up my choice. Fun at the circus. Yeah. And when I win, we'll put up my choice. Elvis. <laughs> the wallpaper. You know, Jess, you can talk the talk, but can you walk the walk? So, uh, how's your bet with Becky coming? Oh, it's going good. I'm just gonna take this off for a while because my back is killing me. Yeah, but Jess, that would be cheating. Don't be such a goody-goody. <laughs> I'm not cheating because of me. I'm doing it for guys across the whole country who shoot off their mouths and have to suffer for it. <laughs> Here, you, you watch the kitchen door. I'll watch the front door. Gotcha. Oh, God. You know, I know uh, us men are cheated out of experiencing the miracle of birth, but... Who cares? Oh. Huh. I bet I could take the weights out of that and put feathers in. Becky would never know the difference. Uh, my neck is killing me. Thanks, Danny. 
Ah, <laughs> uh, can you get my back? Hey, who's watching the kitchen door? I am. <laughs> then who's? Take a wild guess. Oh! <laughs> I'm back. <laughs> Thanks a lot. She didn't come through my door. Back. I'm sorry. I just, I just take a little break here. Look, I'm strapping this puppy right back on. Oh, oh, oh no, 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 no. That's not how it works, buddy boy. I can't unstrap this puppy. <laughs> you lost. I get to pick the wallpaper. Fun at the circus. <laughs> that nursery is going to be full of clowns, all laughing at you. The most important question. Shoot. Why do you want to reopen the Smash Club? Uh, why do I want to reopen the Smash Club? Well, that's that is it. That's a, that's a good question. Why do I want to? Why do I want to reopen the Smash Club? What kind of bread do you want? <laughs> Mr. Katsopoulos, I'm afraid the answer to this one won't be found in a sandwich. Hold the mail, we're busted. Just how long are you going to wear that thing on your head? Until the hot oil treatment reaches full scalp saturation, it says right here. You look like a pan of Jiffy Pop. Uh, Beck, Mr. Baked Potato Head, this is Roxy. Uh, Mr. Baked Potato Head. Why? Oh, hi. Hi, company. I didn't even... I didn't even know. Uh, uh, I guess I should explain the, uh, thing. Uh, <clears throat> my, uh, my, my hairdresser, Alejandro, uh, he found a, a couple of split ends. It's a, a terrible thing. So he figures we can fix this with about six hours of hot oil treatment, a lot of words of encouragement, and if you could uh, swing by the church on the way home and light a candle for my hair, that wouldn't hurt either. All right. She's tightened up. Let's try her out. Great teeter, but I'm not seeing much totter. Okay. Kim, did you gain weight? Yeah, I'm up to 260 now. <laughs> Must have over-tightened it. Let's all push together. All right. On three. Three! <laughs> Nailed that landing.